4G is obviously better than 3G, but what does that mean? Well, here are four things you need to know about 4G. <music> 4G can theoretically run at speeds of up to one gigabit per second, hundreds of times faster than 3G. But it's not just faster than 3G, it's better. It has a much larger capacity. For example, you could be watching catch-up video on the bus, and so can everybody else. Everybody else on the bus can stream video at the same time. Or you can download music in an instant. Maybe you wanna catch up on your emails without the annoying wait. There are actually a number of different technologies that call themselves 4G, and this can lead to serious compatibility issues because of the different frequencies used for 4G in different countries. So just because you've splashed out on a brand spanking new 4G compatible smartphone or tablet, this doesn't mean it's going to work in another country. Best advice, check with your network provider before parting with your cash. The 4G networks are already active here in the UK. There have been some test systems in place for a few years now, but 4G for the consumer finally arrives in the shape of EE's network, which is used by T-Mobile and Orange. Other network providers will be launching 4G services in 2013. We've tested 4G and it really is significantly better than 3G. Even more impressive, it has a longer range, meaning even inside buildings, you should get a decent 4G signal. However, rollout is likely to take a while and you'll not see 4G availability outside of the UK's larger cities for the foreseeable future. For more what is and how to guides, visit the Tesco Technology YouTube channel. And if you have any suggestions for future videos, please leave a comment below.